Hitting close to home tonight as a local nonprofit that has become something so many rely on had to suspend services for a time following an outbreak. Yeah, 44 News reporter Aaron Huber got to speak with the Salvation Army and he's going to share where things stand right now. This marks the first major interruption related to the pandemic that we've seen with the Salvation Army in town. Leaders shared that while an outbreak of COVID-19 was a setback, they're ready to keep moving forward. They had professional cleaners come in and gave time for people to go get tested. For an organization that has several hundred people a day drop by for food and other needs, trying to keep things running as smoothly as possible amid all the changes remains critical. As we head closer to a full year facing continued economic challenges in our community. We are back up and running. Um, we have been seeing our numbers increasing due to COVID. Um, for those coming to use our food pantry as well as our soup kitchen and our financial assistance. Um, so it's great that we've been able to stay open because we know that our community is struggling and they're even um, more in need now with COVID. But facing those challenges head on isn't an easy task. So the Salvation Army is continuing to look for volunteers to help out. Aaron Huber, 44 News. Thanks, Aaron. But we are now